the unboxers, and today we have for you another Lego action figure. Woohoo! Check him out, and it's <clears throat> Captain Kirk. It's time to take a ride on this. USS Enterprise. <laughs> I was gonna say, I was gonna say, it's time to take a ride with our Star Trek friends. It's time to take a ride with our Star Trek friends, and we're gonna be led by Captain Kirk. He is an eight-inch action figure. He has fourteen, 14 points, points of articulation. articulation. So Captain Kirk is an awesome Migo, and we want to say a great big thank you to Migo for sending him to us for free to share with you and add to our collection. He is awesome. All right, so um, you want to go ahead and pick up the packaging? Sure, and I'm not so sure. Um, a numbered one. Yeah, I'm not sure what the number, because uh, like some of the ones actually say like like they're numbered like the uh, I think the Cowardly Lion was like sixteen many? something out of mm -hmm. ten thousand. No, hold it higher. Um, this one is kind of hard to tell on the 4, camera. Four thousand nine hundred fifty-one. Yes, yeah, so I don't know what what out that. Out of how many? You don't. I don't know. know. I don't know if that. Yeah, we don't know. Out of how many? It's um, oh, he's got his little phaser. Yeah, he's got his communicator or, and phaser. Phaser, sorry. Um, but um, yeah, this is um, I'm not sure what wave of figures this is because I couldn't find them listed all online. But this is um, the dress uniform. So there are several Captain Kirk is certainly figures, but this is the dress uniform. And this is his emblem right there. It's really, yeah. really cool. Okay, let's take a look at the back of the box. And I like how it says pop, pop culture on there. So you have Captain Kirk. There's also Mr. Spock, Lieutenant Uhura. Did I say that right? Yes. Mm -hmm. And Romulan, Romulan Com Commander. Romulan Commander. Awesome. So, um, what was I going to say? The, so these are also 8 inch. They would yes. go along with him. Yeah, they, yeah all, uh, most of the standard uh, Mego figures are um, the 8 inch figures. They do have some larger 14 inch figures um, that uh, oh, the but, other, but they, other but they come in like in a, a box and stuff. They, right. These blister packs are the 8 inch. Awesome. So, alright, so we're going to go ahead, believe it or not, and remove Captain Kirk from his box. Maybe we should just beam him up. Yeah. <laughs> and then it wouldn't, the packaging, he could just go right back inside. Yeah. So we're going to take him out so we can give you a closer look. We'll be right back. Okay, and there he is. <laughs> Captain Kirk straight out of the packaging. So let's go ahead and take a closer look at him. He looks really awesome. So obviously he stands on his own. He's like, I stand alone, man. He has a really cool facial sculpt. I like his hair. I like his serious eyebrows. Yeah. But he's got a little smirk <laughs> on his mouth. You know, his lips are kind of turned up a little bit. Yeah, he definitely has that Shatner look. Yeah, he's got little uh, Dr. Spock sideburns, though. He's got very pointy yeah. sideburns. Um, very neat. Apparently, that's the fashion in the future. That's the future fashion. Um, so, and then it has gold around here and gold. But this seems to be a different gold. Like, this is almost like a glitter gold, and this is almost like a material. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then there's a the little emblem. And his, uh, is that like his, his ranking? I'm guessing that's like awards and stuff. You know, like when they do like a military yeah. of the dress. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uniform. Looking really cool. There's his phaser and his um, communicator. Is it attached to his belt? Yeah, actually. Hold on. I remember this from growing up. Oh, it comes just out. slides out so then you can. Oh, wow. Hold on. He'll, he'll bring it back to the camera. Let me zoom out. There we and go. Oh, how cool is that? So yeah, it just now, slides right into the, the little holster wow. thing. Wow, so it's actually a belt thing. Let me show. Uh, there's actually a belt thing that fits around his waist. It's not attached to his pants. I'm trying to show you, like a holster. Yeah, so it just and, slides through in there. Yeah, so, um, and then I think it goes all the way. Go all the way around. Yeah, it goes all the way around, which is really cool. The back of his um, shirt velcros, so you could uh, swap him out with the other one. Yeah. Like uh, with the other uniforms, um, and it's very uh, shiny, very dress-looking um, type of material. And but this is uh, the pants are like, you know, not as shiny, and they're like um, pirate pants. Yeah. And so let's see. So he has black socks and boots, and that's kind of how. And then he's got skin color from there on, but his pants come down like that. I didn't know. Is that how their pants are? Yeah. In Star Trek, that's funny. I guess they wanted to show off the boots. I guess so. Nice boots, man. Okay, now show the points of articulation in Captain Kirk. Okay, so you have the knees, the hips, the um, 
the wrists, wrists which <laughs> the bend elbows. this way and then they have the ball joint. Yeah, so this way and this way. Um, the shoulders, the elbows. obviously the neck, um, and the, he pivots. So yeah, he pivots to the waist and bends at the waist. So you so. can do a really good job of sitting down too. Yes. Yeah, very cool. We had the captain's chair like I had. Yeah, one. there you go. We oh, yeah. need him a captain's chair. Wow, he is looking awesome. Definitely a great um, addition to your collection. Any Mego fans, and especially Star Trek fans, he's really, really cool. I like his sparkly, sparkly, yeah. sparkly dress outfit. So we want to say another great big thank you to Migo for sending him to us for free to share with you today. It has been super fun. He looks awesome. We're going to put him right up next to the Cowardly Lion. Yes. Mm -hmm. And um, right at the end of the video, we will put a graphic up to show you um, the different places where you can find uh, Migos. And also um, the different ways you can um, interact with them online, the website and their... Uh, social media links so you can see all of the the cool Mego figures yes, out there. Yes, all the awesome characters. And um, one of the uh, one of the really cool points about this is even though it's kind of a, like a retro figure, um, and it, you know with it being Star Trek and everything, um, people like me are gonna want to collect it just for the nostalgia um, factor. But um, it's also such a good quality figure that. You know, even kids today. Yeah, um, you can play with it for sure. It. And yeah. with a um, with a fifteen dollar price point, um, it really makes it a very a good affordable. Option. Yes, very affordable. Awesome. And uh, yeah, he feels very well made. You know, you can do the whole. You know. Right. Uh, yeah, they definitely stand up. Evil can evil and all the yeah. stuff that my brother used to do with his figures. So thank you so much for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, tell a friend, and we will see you next time.